There were two supplements I remember specifically that did this very well. There was a supplement called Blue Thunder. Do you guys remember Blue Thunder, the drink <laughs> behind the counter? Yes, I okay. remember that. So, Good chica. Yeah. Yeah, no. ABB made it, right? Yes. Yeah. Blue Thunder, when you turned it around, first of all, it had a lot of caffeine in it. Yeah, okay, so that's like the main reason. It had a bunch of shit. Oh, it had everything. <laughs> yeah. It had all the stuff I read about. Yeah. Yeah. Now, reality, it had like like a tiny bit in there. Yeah, like, yeah. You know. And in liquid forms. So yeah. yeah. Carbons it of thunder right from out. But I remember reading the back of it and be like, oh my God, this has everything that I've ever read about. This yeah. must be amazing. So that, there was another supplement called Hot Stuff. Do you guys remember Hot Stuff? I don't remember Hot Stuff. I've heard you talk about it before. Bro, so there was a whole, one. you guys want to hear something funny. Was it, was it just niacin? No, no, <laughs> no. Hot Stuff. <laughs> the ori There's this rumor about, about Hot Stuff that the original formula contained some anabolic steroids in it. Oh, wow. That, so it was like sold. It wasn't like widely. Oh, so almost like it's it's illegal, almost, right? Yeah. Like it's, it's, you got the Hot Stuff. No, everybody's like, oh, you take the original formula Hot Stuff, you built hella muscle. And then it got popular and apparently they changed the formula this is the wonderful mm. rumors of the muscle building world yeah. but anyway that was another supplement you read the back the ingredients and it was like 85 different things like wow this has ginseng wow this has smilax wow that has everything i've ever read about right <laughs> pixie dusting mike doesn't do that so here's what he put in this new supplement and this new supplement is not it, it is not stimulant based 